say plankton. Yes, what is it? I was just wondering why all the robots seem to be coming from inside the chum bucket. Have they? I really haven't noticed. Uh, yeah. And then there's that big flashing neon sign that says, Robot Headquarters. SpongeBob, I'm your friend, right? No, not really. Exactly. And as your non-friend, I worry about you. Like right now, you're thinking too much. I'm worried you might really hurt yourself. Tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna think for you. This way you won't hurt yourself. And you can just keep working on getting me into the chum bucket. Thanks, Plankton. You're the best non-friend a friend could have. No more thinking for me. Your tree dome is leaking! Them there robots busted up the glass, SpongeBob! I got a treehouse chock full of robots and it's all your fault, so get in there and clean up your mess! Just my size! Fresh like a spring breeze. Ta ching! You've just met the Sponginator. Stop your yapping and let's get robot trapping. Feel like a new sponge. Fresh like a spring breeze. I feel like a new sponge. Tartar sauce. The horror. Much better. I suppose you'll be needing this more than me. Oh, hi, Sandy! My heroes! Hit me with a water ball! Hit me, hit me, hit me! Eh, we don't do that stuff anymore, kid. We're retired. Is that the TV repairman? No, it's that excited sponge kid again. Oh! Uh, are you sure he can't fix the TV? Mermaid Man, twould be my greatest honor to fix your television. Could be! Hey, sponge kid, you really want to help out? Okay, then. Uh, but lighten up a bit on the enthusiasm, huh? Uh, you're making my bowels act up. Uh, we've got a little problem with some robots down in the Mermelair. Are you sure you're up to this task? Absolutely, Barnacle Boy! 
Well, go over to the couch to access the Mermelair. We'll meet you down there. Is it pudding night yet? Barnacle boy. Ah! You shouldn't sneak up on Mermaid Man like that. His heart's not so good. Come to think of it, nothing on him is that good anymore. Sorry, Mermaid Man. It's just that I'm always so excited to see you two. Standing in your awesome presence gives me the chills of justice. See? I've got goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my goosebumps on my... All right, kid. Knock it off. Just tell us what you want. Well, I really want a new pair of sunglasses. Patrick said on my old ones. That's not what I meant. <sighs> Actually, it's a good thing you showed up, young sponge of goodness. It is? It is? Yes, a bunch of evil robots have taken over the Mermelair security system. It's up to you to shut it down and stop them! Well, why him? We're perfectly capable superheroes. Because it's Thursday, and we have a whole bunch of doctor's appointments. Ah, fish sticks. I forgot. Go talk to the Mermelair computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. I accept this awesome responsibility, Mermaid Man. You won't be disappointed. Shamed, maybe, but not disappointed. To the doctor's office! Away! It's not just any sponge, it's Super Sponge, soaking up crime. Fresh like a spring breeze. Hammer, I get it, it shines. I feel... There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. I love opening presents.
fresh like a spring breeze. Go see the computer in the next room. She'll tell you what to do. The Mermelair, secret fortress of the wrinkly superheroes Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy. Squidward, am I happy to see you? And not just the kind of happy you feel in the front of your knees, but the kind of happy you feel in the back of your elbow. Oh, you'll never believe what's been happening. Yeah, yeah, I've already been briefed by the geriatric duo. Those two old coots sent me in to get updated with the Mermelair computer. But since you're here now, I'll let you do it. It's right over there. Oh, look at this place. I mean, police. Would it kill them to lay down a few throw rugs? And all this wasted space? How did those two old fogies make all this? Oh, that's easy. In episode 27, the Mermelair is invaded by the digging monsters of Bermuda, and they... Never mind! I feel like a new sponge. Here, boy. Here, boy. SpongeBob, how do I get out of here? Well, that depends. Do you want the booby-trapped or the non-booby-trapped exit? Non-booby-trapped, please. Then go that way. <laughs> or maybe it was that way.
long as these pants are square and this sponge is Bob, I will not let Bikini Bottom down. like a spring breeze. presents. Here, boy! Hammer! I get it! Take that!
Here, boy. Here, boy. Nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. Feel like a new sponge. like a spring breeze.
Feel like a new sponge. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. It smells like victory. You've just met the Sponginator. SpongeBob. Well, that depends. Do you want non? Then go that way. <laughs> or maybe it was. <laughs> I feel like a new sponge. like a spring breeze. I feel like a new sponge. Go see the computer.
Checkers, the king of non-contact sports. the computer fresh like a spring breeze A new sponge. Got a job for somebody who can throw things. Leave it to us. I'm great at throwing things. All you have to do is pick up a throw fruit and throw it into each of those funnel machines. Throw, throw, throw the throw throw fruit. No, throw the throw fruit. Throw the tofu. You might want to be quick about it. I tend to explode. I mean, they tend to explode.
That's much better.